I'm a visual artist that goes by the name Labrona. I've been painting for about 20 years. I got into art through skateboarding. I went to art school in Montreal, and at the same time, I started doing graffiti. So in the daytime, I would learn how to paint with the teachers, and at night, I would learn how to paint from all of the amazing graffiti artists that I had made friends with. At first, when I started uh, doing street art, uh, it was all on trains with my friend Other. Well, here's some of my old trains. This, uh, you got a guy eating a bird from another guy's mouth. <laughs> it's like a little uh, emotional scene. Here's I used to do portraits. It's like a portrait one. That's a nice picture of all the snow. Some kind of a love triangle. Oh, this isn't the favorite one I've ever done. It's a uh, half a train with oil sticks. But when I went to university, uh, I used to spend a lot of time in the library going through all the art books and I discovered all the old masters and different movements in painting, like German Expressionism and Flemish art. So I used all those influences and melded it together to sort of create my style. I started working on the streets because of my friends who influenced me. But once you start, there's like an adrenaline to it that's really addictive that makes you keep going. I was definitely trying to, to say something. The major message is like you're putting art out in the world for free to, for people to enjoy. And I always like the thought of the trains I painted traveling around and just meeting random people in the world, like all over North America. Well, now that I'm older, I, I work with galleries and, and I do murals. And I, I don't spend as much time doing stuff on the streets or on trains. I don't have time. I'm just trying to be a professional artist. Well, the street art movement is great because it enabled me to be in gallery shows and paint these murals and travel. Um, like, that's a blessing. I'm really, really happy to get all those opportunities. But at the same time, in my heart, I liked it when it was underground and it was just me and my friends. My latest body of work, I'm paying homage to the old masters by using one of their paintings and then remixing it to my own style. I don't know, I just have to paint. It's like painting's my language, so I'm just, just something I'm driven to do. I just want to keep going. I want to paint more work, uh, have more art shows, paint bigger murals, keep progressing. Like you have to progress or your art becomes boring. So make new discoveries, new ways to paint. Like just keep it fresh if I can.